Hey everybody, it's Jay. Uh, today, in this video, I'm going to load a couple of these totes that I've got filled with uh, firewood, hedge firewood. And I'm going to load them on my truck and take them up to uh, our local cooperative and run them across the scales. And kind of give you an idea uh, how much they weigh. <clears throat> now this hedge that I'm splitting now I had cut those trees down with the tree saw uh, probably a year ago and so they um, they've they've been you know drying out somewhat uh, they won't dry a lot until you get them cut up and split of course you know like you want to burn them but when you cut a tree down they do actually start um, losing some of the moisture in them and they were on the ground for about a year before I cut them up into the rounds which is what we've been splitting on the uh, the splitter and the conveyor there. So I'm getting ready to load up the rest of these totes and um, the last video I uploaded uh, I had a comment wanting to know what I thought they weighed so I'm only three miles from our local co-op with a set of scales so I'm guessing from my moisture meter that I've checked these most of these are like 22 23 percent when I split them uh, of course really green hedge is going to weigh uh, more than what these probably will but uh, at least they'll give you an idea you know an average weight I'm guessing they're going to come in somewhere around 13 1500 pounds that's just my guess and uh, we're going to find out though and uh, I'm going to load them up here and take them into town and check them. So I got them loaded up there a little better than I had them while ago. The back will hold them in. So we'll go up there and get them weighed. So they're weighing us now and she'll flag me on when she gets it put in the computer and these scales are accurate within 20 pounds so we're gonna go home and unload them and then I'll be back and get our empty weight times when I sell these totes to a customer if they have a tractor or a skid loader 
on their farm or at their at their home. This is this is how I take it to them a lot of times. It's really simple. I can take two at a time, and it's just about the right kind of load for my pickup. We made it back from the co-op and give you the numbers here um, the total weight of those two pallets was 2660 pounds so we took two of them so that's 1330 pounds a piece and I thought that would be um, a little bit more but I think this wood might be a little drier and I think uh, it's right at 20, 20, between 20 and 23 percent the last time I checked it. So, uh, like I said, those totes that we have here are, uh, they're not quite a full rick. Um, if we'd stack them another four, six, six inches higher, um, that would constitute, you know, a full rick or uh, a full face cord. So by the time you add, you know, that much more weight in a full rick, you're probably looking at 1,500 pounds, close to it. That would sure be, you know, a, a really good average. Um, these are the ones that have like five spacings. And then they have one that has six. And I think if you do the, the ones with six, then uh, you get a little bit over a face cord or a rick. So if you'd stack these this high, it would be a rick. But uh, yeah, these two right here, 1,330 pounds a piece. Um, I'm sure if you just cut a hedge tree down green and split it right then, it's gonna be quite a bit heavier. You know, water weighs quite a bit, so. But yeah, anyway, about 1,300 pounds of wood. 1330 pounds with the tote that give us an idea of what we're hauling around on the back of our trucks so we're going to check the moisture content of these two totes that I just took back or got back from the co-op making sure it's set on wood this is the uh just one I got off of Amazon. And that's showing 13 point, 13.1. Well, that one's same piece but in different spots on 11 so it's drier than I thought and that one's 11.5 so this wood's dry it's a lot more dry than I thought it was which is good it's for next year anyway so get some underneath there a little bit see what it is on most of it so but there's a lot of variables with firewood 
um, as far as the the density of it even within the same species so all we can do is take an average weight of it it'd be safe to say 1500 pounds for a green tote this size 1300 pounds for dry would kind of be an average um, we could check them you know whenever we cut a hedgerow or something down or cut more trees down we can try to get some fairly green and see what the greenest tote would weigh but uh we can do that another time whenever we get tree saws running again after it dries out a little bit but yeah kind of a neat test at least you know where you stand you know with uh with what the weight is you know how much to put on a trailer or on your pickup or thanks for watching today uh, if you don't mind hit the like button subscribe share with your friends and leave us a comment and tell us what you think see if there's anything we left out or anything else you'd like to know about what the hedge weighs uh, dry anyway we know it's dry and we know what it weighs so we appreciate you stopping in and we'll catch you on the next one thanks